Good morning. Welcome to the show. This is exactly like my lounge, there's a Kef logo on the wall, <laughs> behind the television, and pictures of Kef products everywhere throughout my house. I live and breathe Kef. Um, but the reason why we've done this is because we're going to show you a product and we want you to try and imagine where you could use this product within your own homes. But within this room you'll notice there isn't a large rack with amplifiers and DACs and cables everywhere and things like that. Um, all we're going to be demonstrating to you today is these, which are called the wireless LS50s, a pair of Kef stands that cost £400, a project essential turntable, I think it's an essential three, that's £400. Within this cupboard we have a Sony Blu-ray player and a router that is actually set up on network, the Sony 65 inch television and then down there on the floor there is something called an Inuos Zenit uh, NAS drive that is uh, storing music on our network. But elsewhere in the room, over here, you'll see these. These are called LS50s. These are a passive speaker. And a few years ago, we brought out an LS50 in this finish as our official 50th anniversary product. And that went on to win What Hi-Fi's Product of the Year in the awards. And if you go onto YouTube and type in LS50, uh, Kef LS50, there's actually the video clip of where the panel of people actually reached that decision to give it the award and what they say is that the LS50 was that good that they could not not to give it the award for best speaker of the year and we've gone on to bring this speaker out in a variety of different finishes, this is a finish that was brought out four weeks ago, it's a, a matte black finish and we went on to sell thousands of them throughout the world and pick up numerous awards. You would struggle to find a speaker for £800 or even more, slightly more than that could, that could rival that performance. And on, on the other side of the room, you've got three products over there that look remarkably similar. And they are LS50 wireless. Uh, but the difference is that they cost £800 they cost £2,000, so there's a £1,200 difference between them. And the reason is because the LS50 wireless is actually an all-encompassing system. Now I work in sales, and when we first launched LS50 wireless, I had to explain to people what you got for that extra £1,200, because initially a lot of people did raise their eyebrows because it's such a large amount of money more over the passive version, but I'm going to explain to you why they cost more and why they are actually exceptional value for money. So within the box, in each speaker, there is the following. There are two amplifiers. There's an amplifier dedicated to the bass driver and there's an amplifier dedicated to the tweeter. In each speaker, there are two DACs. There is a DAC dedicated to the bass driver, there's a DAC dedicated to the tweeter. Within the speaker system, there is a high resolution audio streamer. So you can connect these to your network via an ethernet cable and at home stream high resolution audio. If you can't connect them to your network by an ethernet cable, they can still connect to your network wirelessly for you to stream music from your network. They have streaming capabilities from Spotify and Tidal built into them. They have room connectivity. Room is something that's going to be very big over the next few years in the UK, it's already massive in the US, but Rune is a system that actually 
takes everything that is on your network at home, no matter where is it stored, and pulls it into one area for you to actually access it. It presents everything to you without you having to navigate to different locations to find your music. They have Bluetooth built in. They have optical input, they have analog input, they have USB input, they even have a subwoofer out. So these are an all-encompassing system that replaces a lot of boxes and a lot of cables that you would normally have within a traditional hi-fi system. But the performance of which, to get the same functionality and services, would cost you probably in excess of £3,000. There are a lot of performance benefits from having everything within this, this diminutive box and all working together and system matched. Now last year when we came to Bristol we demonstrated LS50 wireless by playing three tracks to you from a NAS drive but this year what we're doing is we're going to demonstrate how they perform with various different ways of connectivity such as how you could use these within a lounge environment in your own house. So what we're going to do is demonstrate them playing a piece of music from the NAS drive we're then going to take the optical output from a television into the optical in and play that to you and then we're going to play a piece of vinyl. Now the first track I'm going to play to you uh, is courtesy of my father and my upbringing. When I was a small child uh, being brought up in the, fa in the family Johnson household, when mother and father Johnson were in the house it was Elvis and the Everly Brothers. But when Mother Johnson left the house, my father exposed me to the world of electronica and craft work. So when I was a little boy, breakfast with a bowl of cereal was my dad explaining to me, right, craft work were years ahead of their time. And the track I'm going to play for you is The Model. It's a track that I've loved for the last 30, 35 years. And I'm going to play that through the LS50 wireless that is connected to the uh, Inuos Senate NAS drive. functions and on the top of the master speaker there is a touch control panel that does the same but what I was doing then was controlling it via the KEF app and this is what the KEF app looks like when it's in action. This is the cover of Man Machine which is where the track the model is taken from and this displays the artwork but within the app that is available on iOS and Android there is a feature that makes this a very, very strong product and perfect for absolutely everybody who's looking for this type of product. Because you could actually take it home and set it up in wherever you want in your house, even locations you never thought you could ever put a hi-fi and get it sounding exactly the way that you like to listen to music. And that is because within the product there is what they call DSP, Digital Signal Processing, which allows us to use EQ, Reem EQ to, to actually make the product sound exactly the way you like it. Now within the settings there are basic and expert settings but if you, as an example one of the settings is you can say whether it's mounted on stands or whether it's on the sideboard or a cupboard. Depending upon which one you choose it subtly changes the performance of the system. You can then say whether it is mounted close to the wall or further away from the wall and it's a sliding scale with many many incremental changes that you can make. Again those changes subtly change the performance of the system. You can increase the bass, you can decrease the bass, you can increase the treble decrease the treble, you can plug in the subwoofer and control that from the app. But all of these incremental small changes taken in combination mean that you can actually set a pair of LS50 wireless up and have them sounding exactly the way that you like to listen to music. Now, to take an extreme example of that is the way that I use LS50 wireless at home. I've always wanted to have a hi-fi in my bedroom, but at the end of the day, it's a bedroom and I haven't got room for a hi-fi rack with lots of separates, but I have a sideboard where I could put a pair of speakers, but they would have to be put right up against the wall. So, when I got a pair of LS50 wireless, 
even though they are a rear ported speaker that everybody knows you shouldn't put a rear ported speaker right up against the wall. I was able to take these out of the box, set them up, put them right up against the wall, put on my track that I used to set up a system because I'm so familiar with it and know exactly how I like that to sound and that's Depeche Mode Enjoy the Silence, put that track on and during the course of listening to it I was able to go into the app adjust the settings and I ended up with a hi-fi system in my bedroom that sounded just like it had been put in the perfect listening environment. You can put these wherever you want, you can put them in your kitchen, in your office, in your lounge, in your dining room. So as well as the flexibility of the different ways of connecting them to the sources that you have at home, you've got the flexibility of where you can locate them and get them to sound perfect. Now what I'm going to do now is play something via the television and what we're doing here, there's an optical cable that is plugged into the optical output of the TV and is coming into the optical input on the LS50 wireless. The disc I'm going to play is Dave Gilmore live in Pompeii and what I'm going to do is play time. Now one thing I do have to warn you about is that when I end this demonstration it will end suddenly. is isn't something that I would normally do, normally we'd roll the sound off but I'm just going to stop it suddenly and when I've done that I'll explain to you why I've done. So what I'll do, change the input to the optical input and then press play. <coughs> of different connectivity options, the LS50 wireless remembers your last listening volume, not on each individual input. So say for example, if you're playing your music as loud as you want, your favourite drum and bass track is at the maximum possible volume and then it's 10 o'clock and then you remember that news at 10 is on, if you switch to the input that's connected to your television, you don't have to worry about news at 10 being played at the same volume. It remembers the volume that you were last listening to. Now when we've set this system up for you, we're using three of the different inputs of the LS50 and we've set the volume at a level that we think works in this room. But because we have so many people coming in and out of the room, it, we wouldn't have the time to keep adjusting the volume up and down. So whilst we don't like doing that, it's something that we're kind of forced into doing. But what we're not saying is that everybody who has separate should actually go away and sell them all and you've all got to go away and buy these because you walk at Hi-Fi show and you go in many manufacturers rooms and they're making absolutely glorious sounds from separate uh, Hi-Fi. What we're actually demonstrating to you is that there are solutions for if you wanted to downsize your system or if you didn't have the space or if you wanted to put a system somewhere in another room that perhaps you didn't actually previously consider. You don't have to compromise the quality of what you listen to anymore. There are solutions out there to actually make it easier for you to access music in the way that you want to listen to it. And actually putting additional specification content into a product is something that isn't new to the hi-fi industry. If you think about it, amplifier manufacturers for many years have been putting additional content into their products. So they put in FM tuners or DAB tuners, you can, you can buy amplifiers that have built in streamers and other aspects of the industry are doing the very same thing such as turntable manufacturers. Now this is a £400 turntable from Project, it's a Project Essential 3. But what they've done is they've incorporated a phono stage 
into the turntable, which is great for us because that's one, in, one thing that we haven't put in LS50 wireless. So all we're doing is taking an analog cable out of the back of the turntable and putting it into the analog inputs on the back of the LS50 wireless. Now I'm going to play you a track from uh, London Grammar. If you've been to the Bristol show for the last two or three years, you might very well have heard their first album in its entirety because it's been played in every room for a very long time and quite rightly so because it is an absolutely incredible achievement. This is the second album that they brought out and it's this girl has a remarkable voice and it's called The Truth Is A Beautiful Thing. If you get a special edition there's additional bonus tracks such as a cover version of a live version of the Verbs Bittersweet Symphony. But I'm going to play you the uh, opening track which is called Rooting For You. And one thing I'd like you to think about when you're actually listening to it is that the system that's actually producing the sound that is going to fill this room is only being produced from what you can see. It's this right hand LS50 wireless, it's that left side LS50 wireless and it's this turntable. There isn't anything else in the room but what is going to be produced is that girl's vocals and it, it sounds incredible. Let winter break Let it burn Till I see you again So that's a £2,400 system that delivers every possible way that you can listen to music streaming, high resolution audio, vinyl, all of it but the fact remains that the best way to still buy a hi-fi system is to take your music, the music that you listen to, and go into a hi-fi shop and listen to it on the products that you're interested in, get the advice of the people who are working in the shop, because at the end of the day, it's your brain and your ears in harmony that will tell you where you want to spend or invest your money. But there are a number of things that you can do before then. Obviously, you've all come to a hi-fi show, so that's a good thing to do. You might find something of interest. But then there's magazines and forums and things like that. And over the past few months, it's possibly been very difficult to avoid the LS50 wireless because this is appearing and winning awards all over the world. In the UK, in the last few months, the LS50 wireless has won the What Hi-Fi Award for the best overall system of the year. It was the first inductee into the Watt Hi-Fi Hall of Fame. It won an Easter Award for System of the Year. It got a five-star review in Hi-Fi Plus, and it won the AV Tech Media System of the Year, which is the awards for the group of magazines that include Home Cinema Choice and also Hi-Fi Choice. And this is the February edition of the magazine. It's the current edition, and within that is the review that the LS50 got its award for. But when you read a review by somebody who spends their time listening to products, thousands of products throughout the year, to then advise you what is good and what isn't good and what you should be looking for, when you get to the end of the review, and in a very <coughs> small summary section that has likes and dislikes, and under dislikes he writes nothing of any note, that is when you should have confidence that the product that you would be going to listen to might very well be the solution to what you're looking to achieve at home. Now, we hope that you've actually heard music that you like or had a demonstration that you enjoy. Uh, if you haven't, tell the guys wearing Kev shirts outside because <laughs> in this room we're very fragile. But Inuos, who have supplied this server to us, they've got a pair of Kef LS50 wireless on demonstration. They've actually got them in a finish called Marcel Wonders Nocturne. Marcel Wonders is one of the world's leading interior designers and they're actually at the back of the room and they're luminous and we've set them up with black light to show off the luminous design. So that's the pair that Inuos have. Uh, elsewhere at the show there's a pair of Blade 2's if you want to have a listen to a bigger system in the Cyrus room they're sounding really good 
and if you want to have a listen to home cinema which I believe is quite difficult at this year's show but if you do want to have a listen to it in Sony's room in room 314 they've got a Q series AV system set up with their award winning amplifier. Q series is a range of box speakers that we do and amongst that range is the Watt Hi-Fi speaker of the year the Q350 that retails for £530. So, there are various places you can hear different cat products, but like I said at the beginning, yeah, we've made a bit of effort to make this room look nice, but we're not the only manufacturer who's done so. Throughout the show, there are many manufacturers who've done the same thing, and it's all to make sure that your day is as enjoyable as possible. So, if you haven't had a chance to walk everywhere on the show, I would recommend that you do, because there's a lot of things that you might miss out on that you regret if you don't get a chance. So, I'd like to thank you for coming to the cat room for your time. And